welcome back to Trends and Friends, y'all. As you can see here, I have so many guests here. I am with a couple of our Lubbock favorite food trucks. Thank you so much, ladies, for being on the show today. Thanks for having us. So we have the lady who started it all, Miss Ashley Zubia, with Yano Cubano. So tell us a little bit about what you all are doing here today. So, you want me to hold yeah, this? Yeah, go for it. <laughs> <laughs> so, we wanted to come to represent for our food trucks for a cause. Part two. Um, yeah, part two. So, we started this, uh, we did it in November, just as a thing to give back for the holidays. And we we're like, well, we need to do this more. Like, it, it doesn't have to just be a holiday thing. So, um, we're continuing it. We're going to be out at the Aldersgate Church every last Sunday of the month. Um, last time we had over 22 food trucks there. We're trying to hit that and more this time and just, um, you know, get all the food trucks together, give Lubbock a fun time. We're going to have some music out there, cornhole, face painting, um, and then just the good food. But the best part about it is every food truck is going to be um, saving a percentage of their sales and we're going to be giving it back. So each month we'll do something different. This month, um, Jennifer is super passionate about helping out the medical community. So we're going to uh, collaborate with UMC Covenant, a couple clinics, and go serve our hardworking, very deserving medical staff some good food truck food. So. And let me ask you really quick, when you first came up with the idea of wanting to do this every month, did you think that it'd become this big in Lubbock? Um, kind of, yeah, because, you know, the food trucks are up and coming, and when we all got together, it was just like, well, what can we do that's good? And, you know, definitely such a joint effort to get everybody on board and, you know, just all collaborate and do this. And with all of us together, yeah, I figured it would be pretty big. Um, mm -hmm. If it was just me or just a couple of us, probably not, but with everyone, yeah, yeah. I expected <laughs> it. So let's start off with you. Let's give people at home a little bit of idea about what Food Trucks for a Cause will have. Okay, so... Yano Cubano, of course, we have our Cuban sandwiches that we're known for. Today, I brought something a little different. Um, we started our Sano Cubano menu, which is healthy Cuban. Okay. Um, <laughs> and I just wanted to cater to those who, you know, the bread has a lot of carbs in it, maybe want to be a little bit healthier. So I have our protein bowl. It has um, chicken and pork and awesome. uh, some avocado. And we do like a brown and quinoa rice mixture, so it's not so carby. Then I have our other, um, our Cubano in a bowl. It's a Cuban sandwich without the bread. And then we're doing um, sandwiches and soup here. So it's a smaller sandwich with a side of soup, just because it's cold and soup's yeah. good. So yeah. Something for a little bit of different weather. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who do we have next? Uh, hi, I'm Joanna. I'm with Bubba and Breeze Grilled Cheese. And we do grilled cheeses. We do brisket grilled cheeses, popper grilled cheeses. Right here we have our churro grilled cheese, which is a brown sugar cheesecake. That sounds awesome. Yes. Caramel <laughs> grizzle. Okay. It's, it really is amazing. It's a guilty <laughs> pleasure for sure. Yeah. And then we make uh, homemade limeade. So we have a strawberry limeade, a cucumber limeade. Um, we just actually started soups today. So we had a oh, broccoli wow. and cheddar, tomato mm. basil. So that's going to be starting it on the menu. So anything made manganadas. <laughs> so <laughs> we have next? <laughs> I'm Jennifer and I, ha I own Mijo's Tex-Mex Barbecue. And today I brought tamales just because we have a big, huge, our first tamale festival at Two Dogs. Yay! So super excited <laughs> and so much work goes into that. But yeah, so I brought tamales, but such fun menu that we have with barbecue and Mexican fusion. Awesome. We have our last one. <laughs> well, I'm Mari from Rico Empanadas. Um, bro, you, we do Puerto Rican empanadas is food like meat inside the empanadas. Mm -hmm. We have a special one that we're gonna do for food at a cost. It's our empanadas, but in a Puerto Rican bacalaito mix. It's something very Puerto Rican. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> love it. <laughs> we have our, our own spicy sauce, our pique, our traditional juice from Puerto Rico, and also we do fried pies or dessert empanadas. Yes. Well, thank you so much, ladies, for being on the show today. All this smells delicious, looks delicious, and I can't wait for the second round of Food Trucks for a Cause. I heard so much and saw so much on social media about the good you all did the first round so i'm excited for y'all for the second time around so excited yes for having <laughs> thank you so much for being on the show again thank and you. i hope y'all can keep doing this and definitely just keep getting the word out there and i know food trucks are becoming a new thing so keep getting out there yes. we will so thank sunday you. january 30th yes. uh don't forget yes of course what times <laughs> 11 o'clock to sell out yes, yes. There we go. 11 o'clock to sell out. There we go. And people are ready to see us all together. So they just go there and have us all. Awesome. We have a range of everything. Yeah. yeah, there we go. Thank you so much, ladies. And don't go anywhere just yet. We'll be back with more Trends and Friends.